So let's take a look here at functions for ARM templates. And these allow you to apply transformations to your ARM variables. And they come in two flavors. We have template functions, which are built-in functions, and then user-defined functions, which are custom functions that we're creating to allow uh, what other kind of functionality that we want. So the way functions work is you give the function name. So here it's called equals. And then you have parentheses and you pass in uh, what you want to transform. So if you see parentheses, that's how you know that is a function. So let's talk about some of the built-in functions. And so there are a lot available for us and they're generally self-explanatory. So I'm not gonna be showing examples, but let's just go quickly through the list. So you have array functions like array, concat, contains, create array, empty, first, etc. Then you have comparisons like coalesce, equals, less, lesser equals, greater, greater, or equals. You have date functions. Uh, you have deployment functions. Uh, and for example, parameters and variables are actually functions. Uh, so that's kind of interesting. Then you have a logical operator. So and, or, if, not, or. Numer numerical um, functions like add, div, float, int, min, max. Objects, so contains, empty, intersection. And then you have resources. So uh, extension resource ID, uh, providers, references, etc., like that. Uh, and there's one more, I think we have strings. So we have base64, um, concat, contains, etc. I'm not gonna show you how to do user-defined functions. I don't think that's that important, but I just wanna show you that you have a lot of functions available to you, okay?